Good morning, ma'am. Good morning, sir. I am Giselle Filipina Pagbana from Pumangkas, Sambuan, Cebu, a teacher one applicant in elementary level. So today, I will be showing my teaching demonstration. The subject that I am going to teach is English 3 and the topic is a verb. So here is my lesson plan. Good morning, class! Okay, so now let us all stand for the prayer. Who wants to lead the prayer? Anyone? Okay, try lead the prayer. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Good morning again, class! Okay, we now take your seats. So, how are you today? Is everyone finding happy? Yes, that's great! So now, let us check your attendance. So just say present if your name is called. Is that clear, class? Okay. Oh, wow. No one is absent today. Very good, class. So now, before we are going to start our lesson, who can give me a recap of what we tackled yesterday? Anyone? Yes, yes, very good. We tackle about noun. So what exactly a noun is? Anyone? Yes, people at the back. Yes, very good. A noun is a word that is used to identify places, people, or things. Yes, very good, class. So now, before we are going to proceed to our lesson, can you stand? And let's have an inner gesture first. So all you have to do is to follow me, sing, and move your body as what I do. So here it goes. Clap, clap, clap your hands. Clap, clap, clap your hands. Follow. Clap, clap, clap your hands. Clap your hands together. Next. Stop, stop, stop your feet. Stop, stop. Word 
or a verb. So a verb, they form the main part of the predicate of a sentence. They also the drivers of written and spoken language because they animate that conversation. So I have here some examples of a verb. So here are the examples of a verb. Clap. Walked. And then stop. Write. And then run. Yes, these are the examples of a verb. It's because they are all in action verb. Did you get a class? Okay, so now who can give me an example of a verb? Anyone? Yes, Riza. Wow, very good. Jumping is correct. It is an example of an action word. So let's give a five claps to Riza. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Who can give me another example of a verb? Yes, ah. Uh. Yes, very good. Reading is an example of a verb. Let's give another five clubs for a. Uh. One, two, three, four, five. Last one. Who can give me an example of a verb? Anyone? Yes, Leah. Wow, very good. Eating is an example of a verb. Let's give another five blocks for Leah. One, two, three, four, five. Wow, good job, class. You really get or you really understand our lesson for today. So, now let's move on. Okay, class, let's play a game. Do you want to play a game? Okay. So first, I will group you into two groups. The first row and the second row will be the first group. The third row and the fourth row will be the second group. And I have here a marker and a bunch paper. This is for group one. And this is for group two. So, here is the rules. First, listen carefully. Second, if you know the answer, just write your answer in the pen paper. And if you are done, just waste your pen paper. Is that clear? Okay, very good. So, let's start the game. So, first question. It is a single way that describes what a person or a thing in a sentence does. Again, it is a single way that describes what a person or a thing in a sentence does. Okay, very good. All your answers are correct. Second, what is the verb of a sentence? So, Anthony is throwing a ball. Anthony is throwing a ball. Okay, very good. Throwing is the correct answer. Next, the boy is playing a guitar. Again, the boy is playing a guitar. What is the verb in the sentence? Okay. Playing is correct. Another, Mia is crying. Again, Mia is crying. What is the verb? Wow, crying is correct. And last one, Ben is cooking a food. Ben is cooking a food. Yes, very good. Cooking is correct. Wow, good job, class. All of your answers are correct. It means that you really understand our lesson. Okay? Thank you class. Thank you for participating.
Okay, now I have here a worksheet. So all you have to do is to underline the verb in the sentence directly in the paper. Again, underline the verb in the sentence directly in the paper. Okay, we have one in class and we have one in class. Okay, timer starts now. Okay, five minutes left. Okay, time's up.